Ok, happy to see you here and today we have a really interesting algebra problem. So we have a divided by a divided by a divided by 8. So we have only division, so very simple problem, but a lot of students do this common mistake and I'm going to shoot this mistake here in just 30 seconds. But moreover, you can easily solve it by yourself real quick, we have a, b, c, d, you can easily solve it by yourself and write your suggestion into the comment section and we will check our answer here in just 30 seconds. So I swear it will be really interesting because this is a very tricky question, so trust me. Yeah? Ok, and most of students out there like, yes, can handle this problem, I can handle this, this is basic division, I learned this stuff in the third grade. But a lot of students, this common mistake. Right now I'm not going to tell this is correct or incorrect solution, but I, I want to show you this solution right here. So a divided by 8, divided by 8 and divided by 8. So a lot of students solve it like that. I don't want to tell that this is correct or incorrect, but a lot of students solve it like that. Just look at it. So a divided by 8. They know that this is equal to 1 and they say, ok, right here equal to 1. a divided by 8, they know about it, equal to 1 as well. So in this division we have in the middle, so 1 divided by 1 equal to 1. And a lot of students, ok, option A is a correct answer to this problem. And I'm going to show you a correct order of operation, because it looks like a kind of weird uh, order of operation, because if you look a little bit about PMDMC order of operation, the main order of operation in the world, so all internet libraries work according to PMDMC order, there are a lot of different orders of operation, of course the most popular bodmans, but this is the old one, this is like all internet libraries work according to PMDMC. And what this PMDMC tells us? Tell us that we need to start from parentheses, because we go from the top to the bottom, and the first step is parentheses. So a divided by 8, I just read this problem real quick, a divided by 8. What is the first step according to PMDMC? According to PMDMC, the first step is these parentheses. So are there any parentheses right here? No, I don't see any of those, so we just keep this part. What about the next step? Exponents. So are there any exponents right here? No, I don't see any of those. We don't have any exponents, so which is real great. We don't have any squares cube, which is really important for us. What is the next step? Multiplication and division part. So are there any multiplication and division sign? Yeah, I have this division sign right here. We have three division signs, which is really great. This is our case. We don't have multiplication, which is really great moreover. Yeah? So division, this is our case. And PMDMC works from the left to the right. So we need to scan what is the first sign from left to right. The first sign from left to right, if you look closely, is this division. Yeah, doesn't matter, it will be like multiplication division, we need to look at first sign from left to right, If, of course we are talking about multiplication and division part. Ok, a divided by 8, this is our first step, because the first sign from left to right is this division. a divided by 8 equal to like 1, yeah? 1 divided by 8, and I just rewrite this question, because we still have these two 8s. Ok, what is our next step? We still have division and we need to look once more, what is the first sign from left to right? The first sign from left to right is this division once more, ok? So we need to divide, but 1 over a, 1 divided by 8, this is not like an integer right here, so let's write it as a fraction, so 1 over 8, and we still have this division in the end, ok? 1 over 8 divided by 8, this is 1 over 64, or if you're talking about division, 1 over 8 times 1 over 8, yeah? This is our answer. And if we're talking about an option, we have, looks like uh, our option D will be our answer, because 8 to the power minus 2, this is 1 over 8 square, which is 1 over 64, yeah? So this is explanation why our D is a correct answer to this, to this question. But I want to go back a little bit before, because we have right here this, this solution. Why this solution is incorrect? Because we cannot like jump from the left to the right, right here we divide, we want to divide right here, we want to divide on the right. And this is incorrect solution. But I'm going to show you when it will be correct solution. Because if you put parentheses, if you put brackets, then we need to start from it, yeah? If you need to, st you need to start from these parentheses, and then we, this is our first step, a divided by 8, 1, a divided by 8 right here, 1, so option A will be correct answer. But right here we don't have parentheses, so this is incorrect solution. Correct solution is option D, so I just write it right here, so answer, this is option D, 1 over 64, this is option, option D. This is my solution to this problem. If you made this error, I'm happy you made this, because you won't make this again. But if your answer is the same as mine, which is really great, I really appreciate it, and I'm really happy that you solved it correctly. 
Definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong, okay? Now if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain tests, you can easily subscribe to my channel. Or if you wanted to support me, I really appreciate it if you leave a like below this video. Thank you for your time, have a great day, I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventures.